Mula is known for making some amazing safety razors. They also make shaving creams and shaving soap and other accessories. I wanted to test out one of their shaving creams, so I bought their Sea Buckthorn Shaving Cream. So this shaving cream has a citrus scent. You're mostly going to smell orange. It does have a little bit of lime in there, but that's not as noticeable. I'm actually a pretty big fan of citrus scented products. Uh, this one did have a little bit too much sweetness in it though. That orange scent that came through was just too sweet for me. So I do wish that they had cut back on that. That's one of the negatives of the shave cream. I still think you'll like this if you like citrus scented, you know, shave products or anything like that, any other grooming products. Just be aware that it is a little bit sweeter. Some of the tools that I used for this shave in this review specifically are this Royal Shave Barber Supply Mini Bowl. The bowl is pretty new. I've only had it a few weeks. I'm gonna be uploading a video review about that soon, so stay tuned. And then I used the Manscaped Plow 2.0 Safety Razor. And then I have this Omega brush with a beehive handle. I'll put the specific model number that in the video details. This was also my first time using the Merker Super Platinum Blades. I normally use feather blades or derby blades if I'm out of the feathers. I really enjoyed these Merkers and I think I'm gonna be adding them to my rotation and using them a lot more now. Now I'm gonna be using Porosso just as a reference point so that you guys can better understand how this Mula shaving cream compares to Purasso and how the lather, you know, turns out. I do wanna highlight that Mula used beeswax in the shave cream. And I think that that's one of the reasons why the shave cream is actually a lot creamier than Purasso. I think this is one of the most creamy lathers that I've ever gotten. It's especially thick too. I'm gonna to try and show that on the video. Uh, some soaps that I've tried out, other ones just create a thin, runny lather, and this one's the complete opposite of that. Now, I did use the same amount of cream and water that I normally use when I lather other soaps, including Pro Rosso, and this one was just exceptionally thick. Lathering the shaving cream up was also very easy. It didn't take too long. I only swished my brush around in the bowl for about 45 seconds and got a really good, decent amount of lather. Um, as you'll see in this mini shaving bowl that I'm using, it is too small and I got a bunch of the cream starting to pour over the side, so I'm going to buy a bigger bowl. Royal Shave Company does make a bigger version of this mini bowl. I think this is a good one if you're traveling, but for everyday use at home, I would recommend getting a bigger one. Now, performance-wise, when it comes to actually using this when you're shaving, to be honest with you, I feel like it was just a little bit better than Prorosso. Prorosso is one of my favorite shaving creams, but I wanted to expand into trying other shave creams and other products, other brands. Now, when I say that the shave was just a little bit better, I actually felt like my cheeks were smoother after I shaved this compared to Prorosso. Now, I don't know if it's, you know, a combination of the new Merker blades that I was using along with this shave cream, but this shave cream just felt softer on my face. And as I was shaving, I felt like I got a little bit of a better glide and just a smoother glide as I was shaving. Now, this shave cream is $5 more expensive than Purasso. Right now, it's $15 on Amazon. Purasso normally runs uh, runs around $10 on Amazon year round unless you find a good deal. So there is a price difference there. That doesn't always mean things are better, but in this case, I think this one actually performs better when you're shaving. So if you're willing to spend five more dollars for a high quality shave cream, I recommend this one. And again, I wish that they had cut back on the sweetness from that orange scent. But overall, the shave that I got from this was amazing. A little bit better than Purasso. Very smooth, very soft. I, absol I absolutely love the shave. Mula does make other scents of the shave cream, like an aloe. There's also a grapefruit and mint scent, which sounds really interesting to me. But I would say if you're into wet shaving, definitely give this one a try. That's pretty much all I had to say about the shave cream, guys. Leave some comments and let me know what you guys think or if you have any other recommendations. Let me know in the comments. Also, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching my video today, guys. Have a great day. I'll talk to you next time.